This is moss, a common but largely unnoticed element of the natural world. They are one of the oldest plant species existing even before Jurassic era. This shows their tremendous resilience and this strength is reflected in various biochemicals found in them which are still a matter of research. Mosses grow all around in a variety of ecosystems. They are small flowerless plants. Mostly seen in moist areas, mosses are important indicators of the health of ecosystem and pollution levels. They are pioneer species and the first plants to grow on rocky land by breaking down the rocks to help form soil. They help to create a suitable environment for other plants to grow. Mosses have high water retention capacity which makes them an excellent packaging material. Explore the magical world of moss in India's first ever moss garden at Khurpatal in Nenital district of Uttarakhand. Popularly known as a divine lake, Khurpatal's moist climate provides a good environment for its growth. Spread over 10 hectares, this moss garden houses more than 60 species of moss and other bryophytes. This garden has been developed by the research wing of Uttarakhand Forest Department. The moss garden aims to conserve several species of moss at one place and make people aware of their ecological significance besides creating a recreation center for tourists. Here, one can discover some interesting, fun and unique facts about these small flowerless plants. This garden also has an interpretation center in which different aspects of moss are displayed through models. There is a photograph from the First World War which shows the use of sphagnum moss as a dressing for wound. Moss has antiseptic, antifungal and antibacterial properties which made it perfect to cleanse and heal the wounded over the course of the war and proved to be better than cotton. This interpretation center also exhibits ornaments made of live mosses which are highly popular in Japan. One will also see a moss terrarium displaying an actual ecosystem and some moss balls. The garden features a dinosaur model displaying the existence of mosses way before the Jurassic era. Then there are bird nests made of moss. Birds use moss as a material for temperature regulation and antibacterial purposes. Tufa is a living structure made by specialized mosses which acts as a natural filter to deposit calcium carbonate present in water. A moss trail of 1200 meters has also been set up in the garden. This trail has several moss species along with scientific information about them. These mosses enhance the beauty of the shady trail of Ringal. Ringal or hill bamboo is used indigenously for preparation of baskets, mats and brooms in Uttarakhand. Walking through the trail, one can see old rooms of a bungalow of an English soldier. This undisturbed trail is home to a large number of bird species. The garden houses many important moss species like the rose moss which resembles a small green rose. Pocket moss. Its leaves contain a pocket-like structure on one side of the midrib. Rounded tongue moss. It has tongue-shaped leaves. Umbrella liverwort. It has cup-shaped receptacles known as gemma cups in which gemi or the reproductive spores develop. Although most mosses and other bryophytes can grow on variety of surfaces, but some of them can grow only where their preferred mineral is present. In this way, particular mosses may help in bioprospecting of certain minerals like the copper moss which grows only on rocks which contain cuprous compounds. Inspired by the serene botanical gardens of Japan, this initiative of the Uttarakhand Forest Department will go a long way in mending the relationship between mankind and nature.